Welcome to VOGA 3D Anatomy and Pathology, a comprehensive 3D atlas for exploring the human body. In this guide, we'll walk you through the app's key features and navigation. VOCA 3D Anatomy and Pathology is available as both a web application and mobile apps for iOS and Android. To access the web version, enter catalog VOCA IO in the search bar. This will take you to the home screen. Here you'll find the main navigation bar at the top, which provides access to anatomy, pathology, articles, and the help center. The top toolbar also includes search functionality, language settings, and a login button. Once you register, you can access the entire 3D atlas and add models to your personal collection. To explore anatomical models, select Anatomy in the top menu or click the Anatomy box on the home screen. The Anatomy section is divided into three categories. Regional Anatomy, which covers specific body regions and organs. Systemic Anatomy, focused on body systems and microanatomy, which dives into structures and tissues at a microscopic level. To learn how to manipulate the 3D model, let's dive into regional anatomy. In the side menu, you can navigate all available sections. By clicking the three dots next to any section, you can share a link and save the section to your personal collection. You can also use the share button and star icon on the right to do the same. If you want to save specific models to your collection, click the star icon on their preview images. At the top right, you can also use the sort menu to organize models in different ways. In regional anatomy, you'll find full body anatomical models for both males and females. Let's use the male model as an example to explore how you can adjust the display modes. Click on a model to view it in 3D. Larger models may take a moment to load. To rotate the model, point your cursor at the model, hold the left mouse button or the touchpad, and explore the model from any perspective you want. In case you want to move the 3D model to another location on the screen, just press the mouse wheel or click and hold the bottom right corner of the touchpad to adjust the model position. For zooming in, point the cursor at the model and scroll up with your mouse wheel. If you're using a touchpad, simply pinch to zoom. Place two fingers on the touchpad and spread them apart. If you need to explore a specific model part, simply click on it and a pop-up will appear with its name in your selected language and Latin. Plus, you'll get access to handy tools to interact with the selected area. You can drag the toolbar anywhere on the screen to keep it right where you need it. If you want to hide a selected area, click the eye-shaped hide button to remove it and get a clearer view of what's inside. If you want to focus on just one selected part, use the isolate button. You can also make the selected area transparent by clicking the fade button. If you need to work with multiple structures, the multi-select button lets you choose several parts at once, allowing you to hide, isolate, or adjust their transparency. Need more details about the selected area? Click the eye icon to open a detailed article. You can move the article around by clicking and dragging its title. The arrows above also let you undo or redo any changes or even reset the model if needed. If you reset by accident, a confirmation pop-up will let you cancel the action before it applies. VOCA 3D Anatomy and Pathology offers extra features in the web version that help you annotate, highlight, and sketch on the models. They can be found in the toolbar on the right. In the Parts tab, you can check out and explore different structures of the selected model. If you're looking for something specific, you can type the name in the search bar for quick access. From this menu, you can also interact with structures just like in the pop-up toolbar. You can hide, isolate, fade, and manage multiple selections to customize your view. The Tools tab offers several useful features. The pointer lets you visually highlight areas on the model by moving your mouse or swiping on the touchpad. You can also customize its color for better visibility. To close the color selection options, just click the Done button in the upper right corner. A text feature allows you to type notes near the model. 
You can change the font size and color, and also adjust the note's position and size. An image feature lets you upload additional visual materials next to the model. You can also take a screenshot to capture a high-quality shot of your 3D model. Get your model set up just how you want it and hit the Take a Screenshot button in the upper right corner. You can download the image or copy it to your clipboard for easy sharing. The 2D pen lets you draw on top of the entire scene, add notes, highlight areas, or draw arrows next to the model. When using the 2D pen, the model stays fixed without accidental movement. To use the 2D pen, simply hold down the left mouse button and move the cursor to draw. A 3D pen helps you sketch directly on the model's surface to create freehand structures. Unlike the 2D pen, it won't draw in empty space, only on the model itself. Just hold down the left mouse button and move the cursor to sketch in 3D. If you need to rotate the model, hold down the spacebar and the left mouse button to adjust your view. By clicking on the background tab, you can switch between light and dark backgrounds. If you explore models in the systemic anatomy category, there's one more unique tool you should know about. In the toolbar on the right, you'll find color highlighting that differentiates areas on bone structures. Plus, you can make the model full screen by tapping the two arrow icon at the bottom of the right panel. This will hide all the buttons and give you a better view. Need a quick refresher on the tools? Just click the light bulb icon for instant guidelines. When you're done working with a model, you can save it, share feedback, or explore more models. In the left panel, you'll find the star icon, which lets you save the model to your personal collection. Plus, you can send your thoughts about the model or app directly to the VOCA team. If you want to explore other models from the collection, just click the Models button in the left panel. This will show you all the submodels under the theme you're using. If you click Catalog, you can browse all the models in the current category or switch to the complete catalog list. If you want to move to Pathology, select the corresponding button in the top menu or click the Pathology box on the home screen. Here you'll find various categories, with new ones added regularly. Pick a category, and you'll land on a page similar to anatomy ones, but with a couple of twists. Each category includes a detailed 3D model of a healthy organ at the top, and in-depth articles on related pathologies. Clicking on an article opens a detailed description of the pathology from an anatomical perspective. In the top right corner, you can save it to your collection, copy the link, download it as a PDF or print it out. To see the 3D models in action, click Go to Pathology to explore them. While studying 3D pathology models, you'll notice a tool called Topography on the right toolbar. This feature helps you visualize anatomical structures within their surrounding areas, giving you better spatial context. Everything else stays the same, so you'll still have full access to all the familiar tools. If you want to customize your account settings, click your profile icon in the top right corner. On the left side of the page, you'll find options like personal information, change password, and appearance, allowing you to tailor the app to your preferences. The mobile version of VOCA 3D Anatomy and Pathology works just like the desktop version, except for some interaction and customization tools. Instead, you get to play around with 3D models in AR mode. Just hit the AR icon at the top right of your screen. When you're in AR mode, point your camera at a flat surface and tap to drop the model where you want it. You can rotate it, zoom in or out, hide or isolate parts, and see names for the structures you select. To switch back to the normal view, just tap the MB icon. We hope this guide will help you make the most of VOCA 3D anatomy and pathology and enhance your exploration of human anatomy. Thank you for watching.